So I've talked about a lot in Mirage that there's some unique aspects about this world. And one of those things, one of those areas that I'm about to show you, and this area is just when I got to it uh, the first playthrough basically when I was speedrunning it, I was super excited to see this area. I'm like, wow, I did not expect to see this. And I was kind of sad because when Blue and I were speedrunning it, I couldn't take the time to look around. But since then, I've looked around, and it's just overall a really cool area, a neat little addition to Mirage. So I'm going to teleport over there, and we'll have a look at it. It's called Thieves' Den. And uh, any Star Wars fans will immediately recognize it. So I want to take in the music, too. Let's just turn up the music a little bit so you guys can... Get the full effect. Also, sound effects, maybe? Wait, the, the music here is considered a sound effect? I don't even know what that changes. So I guess it's considered a sound effect. Okay. So, this is basically the Star Wars Cantina. And you can see the band over there playing the music. It's got a bunch of sound effects to it. The sound effects kind of go together with the music, I guess. But you can hear people talking. You can hear the, the clattering of glasses and stuff. And the other cool thing is you'll recognize a lot of... Look at this guy walking. <laughs> is he dancing or walking? I think he's dancing. <laughs> so you'll recognize a lot of characters here. Let's turn it out a little bit. You'll recognize a lot of the NPCs that they put in this area because it's kind of full of a little little Easter eggs and gems from other worlds. So I'm gonna collect this thing, and the music kind of dies down when you get further away. So immediately we see Balor right here, or Baylor, whatever his name is, and uh, he's chilling out right here with his eye patch and everything, just talking to some people from you know Avalon. We got a badger, and then we also got this this guy here. <laughs> Ozzy's like staring him down. <laughs> So this is a little area, a bunch of the new mobs that we see all around this area. A couple uh, side quests in here too, these little rooms. I expected in one of these little rooms to see Han Solo somewhere in here, hanging out, talking to an alien guy. I mean, there's no really aliens here, but who knows? There's a lot of Star Wars references in this. I mean, this whole area is basically a Star Wars reference. We got a Polarian penguin dancing in front of the, the cantina band. Look at this guy. I don't think I've seen this guy. It's like a It's like a Mander from Krakatopia. But uh, you know, he got a job at the cantina. Playing at night for everyone. And then uh, of course, probably one of the best characters in this entire place is Beachbeard right here. Now, what is this triangle thing that he has? This, it's not really a triangle, it's a pyramid. I don't know what that is. I'm not sure if it's some kind of... I don't remember there being anything. I don't know. Some kind of artifact. But yeah, Boochbeard is right here talking to uh, someone from... I mean, I was thinking that it was someone from Pirate, but it also could be someone from Wizard too, because there are horses in Wizard and Pirate. You can also listen to him talking. Let's see if we can turn it up. You can, like... Was that a quest? Go <laughs> talk to Morgan Lafitte? Do they just do Does he just say like random lines of, of quest dialogue and just... I think he just says like random things. That's pretty cool though. I like that. Also over here we got someone from Avalon. One of the ogre guys. And then we also got someone from Pirate. Arm wrestling. And then in the corner... In the shadows, we've got a ghost dog. Look at him. Look at ghost dog. Probably one of the cooler boss characters that we've seen from Chrysalis right there. He's also tapping his foot to the uh, the music. Is he? Yeah, he is. He's tapping his foot to the music. <laughs> so <laughs> there's ghost dog hanging out. Basically, just all of our enemies and friends. I mean, not that our wizard knows who Weechbeard is. Kind of coming together in this cantina. Oh, we've also got uh, one of the 
one of the other chrysalis bosses here. And this area is a little mob area. Some chrysalis bugs over there. Another artifact. Let's click this artifact. Antique unicorn statue. So, that's basically the cantina. Then these guys you talk to for your quest. So, really interesting area that I just had to share with you guys because when I got here initially, I was really surprised that there was even an area like this because it's kind of hidden away and you go through it in order to get towards the later half of the game. There's also some other guys here that have some quests for you. These guys, I think their quest is involving pirate. Let's listen to it. Mighty wizard, please stay and hear our tale of woe. Yep. The fate of an entire crew hangs in the balance. Oh, we're dead. We're so dead. We are humble sky pirates, held here by Ali Baboon until our captain and first mate Akbari brings the Dune Star as our ransom. If the scale demons ate them, Rahim and I are as good as Rancor food. Please. You are an adventurer, no? Could you brave the scale demon's nest and secure the Dune Star to pay our ransom? Yes? Thank you. Sinbad. Hmm. Interesting. So, that's a side quest that you can do from here. I just wanted to show you guys that it has like a pirate kind of spin to it. So, interesting how they uh, kind of mix those in this place. Oh yeah, and then we got another mander. Right there. Look at this guy. <laughs> so, really cool area. Just had to share it so that you guys were aware of it. And uh, you can look forward to seeing this when you venture through Mirage. Also, these gobbler guys are kind of the newer gobblers that we see in Mirage too. So, tons of interesting characters here. We've got the dancing, uh, dancing camel guy who, I don't really know what his job is, but I think it's just to kind of hype everyone up. So, that's going to do it for this video. Just wanted to share this with you guys. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, and I'll see you all next time.